Did you hear the news last week about the brand new models from ChatGPT? Well, you may have. You may also have heard they have a brand new plan for $200 a month. Today, I want to help you understand, is that plan for you? And I think the answer is really simple. So first I want to talk briefly about the new models. Uh, these are actually the models that were in beta that are now available for you to take a look at. Uh, that model is going to be your O1 model and your O1 mini. These are now available to you, normal, publicly released, and everybody has access to them. So uh, great models. The big difference between the 4O model that most of us are familiar with and the O1 models is simply the amount of reasoning that goes through. So when you've got a, a prompt or a situation that requires some additional reasoning, maybe some additional thought, then these are great models to consider. 4 will still be, be my default go-to, but it's nice to know we've got some extra horsepower if needed. The next big question is their brand new plan that's unlimited, they say, in every respect, and it includes their newest models, but it's $200 a month. And the real question is, is it worth it? Is it needed? I think a lot of this depends on what you're doing. If you're doing deep research, especially in scientific and mathematical areas, then absolutely, I think it may be worth the $200 a month. If you're focused more as I am on digital marketing and general productivity, I'm not sure that the O1 model brings with it, especially in the unlimited use capabilities, the things that we need in a $200 plan. Now again, there's nothing wrong with that. $200 in order for the value that brings, probably well worth it for many users. But I know I'm personally not upgrading yet simply because of the fact that I'm able to get the results that I need out of 4.0 and the usage that I do have, even though it's not unlimited, in the O1 and O1 Mini models. So it's important to know you do still get to use the O1 model and the O1 Mini model in your normal paid plan, but it's not unlimited usage. You're gonna have some usage caps that you run into. So again, if you're working on mathematical stuff, scientific things, absolutely that $200 plan is worth considering. But if you're a normal small business owner like I am and you're just trying to figure out how do we use AI effectively on a day-to-day -day basis, I don't think you probably need to seriously consider that plan. I know at this point, I'm not gonna go for it, even though unlimited usage sounds great, I'm not running into any caps, and candidly, I love the ability to move back and forth between multiple different applications, such as ChatGPT, Claude and Perplexity. In this newsletter, I'm gonna include uh, links to a couple of videos that I recently did. You may have seen them in a past newsletter I just did over the weekend about the various ChatGPT and Claude models, just to help make sure that you're up to speed on those. And if you have any questions, let us know. We'd be happy to record some more information about that as well. So we're gonna dive into a few of those changes here this week. Hopefully you're gonna enjoy them. I wanna encourage you, we're trying to increase our volume of emails to give you more and more information as we've got so much going on. You'll start seeing regular emails throughout the week. We'll always do our Monday email like this, but we're going to also try to continue to get you updates throughout the week as things change. We're also putting out a lot more training videos, and so you'll see those as well. And we'd love your feedback. If there's things you'd like to see or things that you're questioning about AI, let us know so we can create content for you to help you through that. Thanks and make it a great day, everybody. Bye-bye.